This is how we do an oil change on a Fumoto valve, a Subaru. This is the little uh, clip that holds it into the little arm into place the valve. What I like to do is do this when the engine's warmed up so that the oil flows out faster. It's got a tiny little ball valve in there, so here we go. Push down on the spring. It's coming out. And I'm going to change the filter too. <clears throat> I opted to get the one with the uh, little nip nip on there uh, because in the future I'm going to have a skid plate go across here and we're going to have a uh, little hose attached to it so that you can just reach under the skid plate and twist it open and then it will drain out uh, wherever the hose is located and I think that's pretty cool cool idea for the future Go grab a filter. Clean off the surface. Let me make sure there's no dirt. And then get the little, little bit of oil on the filter seal here. Okay, this is just about done draining. So the official uh, factory says that when the stream becomes like this, then it's good to uh, shut off. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And this is extra security. But you can see the valve has a little step when you rotate. So it's not going to do anything unless you push down on the spring to get past that step. And then when we're done, we get this extra little clip. The little groove on the one side is going to go over here. And it's going to lock into place so that it won't, you won't be able to push down. It's extra security. And then we uh, top it off upstairs with the oil fill cap. You know, fill in the oil, but I just wanted to show you what, how uh, much easier it is to do the oil change with this valve. But be, be aware that it can affect your ground clearance. The one with the nipple I got just because um, I'm going to have a skid plate in the future. Alright guys, I think it's totally worth it to have one of these. <clears throat> I'm, I'm pretty convinced. Before I wasn't, but now I am. You don't have to wear out the threads every time you and put a new gasket on every time you change the oil. You just flip the switch and you're done. Cool. Yeah, so let me know what you think. You got any questions or anything, just you know, hit up the comment section. Do you have death threats or hate me? Comment section. That's what it's there for, bruh. Yeah, dude.